Hello everyone, it's Ali from Titan and welcome back to our channel. I am here at their second and final personal break of the day and as you all can see down here in the corner, we're going to be getting on into three of the 2022-23 Leaf Basketball Blaster Boxes. These are for Greg S. from Iowa. So thank you so much, Greg, for letting me open up some more Leaf products for you here on the channel. I hope to find you some awesome cards to add to your collection. Now these Leaf Blaster Boxes, we've checked out Leaf Baseball, Leaf Football, and some of these Leaf Basketball here before. And I will say they are quite fun. Now, of course, being a Leaf product, these basketball cards are not NBA licensed, but do still feature a lot of really cool players from both the NBA, the WNBA, and I believe also some collegiate players as well. But in each of these blaster boxes, you do get one 10 card base set, which you can get in a couple different parallel colors, but every box will have the same 10 cards plus one autograph. Now we've seen some numbered autographs before, gold autos, blue autos. I'm very excited to see what kind of autos we find here for Greg. So real quick, before we get started, would like to mention that I'm still in the running for that cosplay star competition. Pretty big elimination coming up this Thursday night. So please, if you have not yet done so today, please make sure to go ahead and cast your completely free daily vote. Takes like 10, 15 seconds max. So that link is pinned in the comments down below, but if for some reason it's not showing, the link is in the description as well. I'd greatly appreciate it if you could do that once every 24 hours. That's all I ask. But anyways, back here to these boxes for Greg. Let's go ahead and get started. Bye snapping us into the corner let's see what we can find now of course the boxes advertise keegan murray and alan iverson but let's see what we do end up finding in here let's see also we can find a different different colored sets i think we've seen the base the gold and red before looks like we do have a gold set here in box number one so they do come in these little cases unfortunately I mean, they stay nice and secure, but unfortunately, these leaf stickers leave a ton of residue once you open them on up. I haven't had luck cleaning any of the ones that we've opened, honestly, getting all of the sticker gunk. Now, these honestly look like they're coming off more cleanly than some of the other ones I've opened. Ah, see, ones like that. Maybe like some lighter fluid if you really scrubbed at it. I don't know if it's worth it, though. And just leave it as is. But yes, it does come in these little containers. I will take out the auto and sleeve and top load, whatever our auto is, but I will put the sets back inside these containers and then ship them like that for Greg. All right, so we'll look through the set. Oh, I don't want to spoil the auto. Come on. Oh. I don't want to hold the, I don't want to hold that either. All right, let's look at the set. We do have Derek Lively, Scooter Henderson, who I believe has changed his nickname to just Scoot. So Henderson here, Arthur Kaluma, Gigi Jackson, Mackenzie Mako, Matas Buzelis, Nick Smith Jr., Benedict Matherin, Dyson Daniels, Last card of the set, we do have Keegan Murray. All right, so for our first auto, looks like it is a regular border. I don't remember if the regular bordered autographs still were numbered or not, but we'll find out shortly. We do have Matats here, one of our athletes from that base set. So limited, okay, so limited to only 99 copies. They're not individually numbered, but it does say for each color. So I'm guessing this is the base, this is the gray, something like that. So Matas here, 299 is our first auto. So rookie, but of course not NBA licensed. All right, one of our featured players from the set. That's neat. All righty, so first auto is 299. I'm curious how low we can go here for Greg. All right. Go ahead and get on into box two. So again, 10 cards in the set will be the same, potentially different color on the border. So let's see. Do, 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 do. We do have a base set this time around. All right, so let's peel the sticker. All 
lady. So it looks like our auto is going to be a base auto as well. I'll breeze through the set real quick just so you all can see what they look like with this color border. But again, same assortment of players. All right, time for our auto. Again, should be another one of the base autos. I wonder if it would also be number 299. We have here, we do have Jet Howard. Yep, also to 99 here. So Jet Howard, rookie auto. So 6, 7, 185. I remember, I'm just not too well versed in basketball, as you all may be able to tell by certain uh, mispronunciations I may or may not have had so far in this video. But it's, it's like, I know basketball players are really tall and like not very, I don't want to say big, because obviously they're like really big dudes, but not you know, not like the same shape or size as a soccer player or a football player or a baseball player. It's a different kind of athleticism. It just blows my mind how much they don't weigh. Like you're like right here, Keegan Murray. All right, six eight two twenty five. That to me, I can fathom. Six seven one eighty five. It's like, bro, are you okay? I don't know. I I'm just jealous. It's like they barely weigh more than me, <laughs> and they're like over a foot taller than me. Embarrassing. <laughs> that it just blows my mind looking at like height and weights of different basketball players. I would not have expected it. I don't know what I expected in the way, but not that little. Not that little. It hurt. It, 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 it takes me down a peg for my self-confidence every time I open up these blaster boxes and I look at their weights. All right. We did go three for three on different colored sets as we do have a blue parallel set here. I'm not sure what the rarity goes if red is more rare than blue. I think the blue autos were to 49. And the gold autos were to 75. Now, not that the base sets are numbered at all, but in terms of rarity, I think they descend in the same order. So pretty neat here that we got one gold set, one base set, one blue set for Greg. So Greg has three sets. They are, they are different. They're all different colors, so... That is the only bad thing I'd say about these blaster boxes is it's like not super conducive to buying multiples is it's like you just get the same thing over and over again, but we did get different colors. So I appreciate the parallels of the base set. Happy we got actually straight up three different ones here. All right. So looks like we do have a gold auto this time around. I think they're to 75, but we will see, of course, once we get there. I think this blue set's a bit better centered than our base set was. All right, here is our auto gold auto of, we do have Johan Traore, number to 75. So yeah, it's limited to 75, not numbered. Most misspoke there a bit because it's not individually numbered, but 275 limited. Reminds me of how Onyx Vintage does Onyx Authentication does their vintage lines, vintage collegiate football, vintage football, basketball, baseball as well they've done, where the ink, you look at the back of the box and it'll show how rare the ink colors use. So like, the, I think the blues were like to 50 and so on and so forth. So they're not individually numbered, but they are limited. Same kind of deal here. You see the gold border, you know there's only 75 of them, even though there's you don't know if it's number one of 75 or 42 or 69. You don't know which one it is. But alrighty, so we did have three different color sets, two base autos, and one gold auto here for Greg. So Char right here does not appear to be a rookie, although I'm not sure if he is collegiate. Because that is not a name I recognize. But Maybe pre-rookie, who knows? But let's take a look at our autos here. Matas Buzelis to 99. Jet Howard to 99. And Johan Traore to 75. And of course, again, just a quick look here. I got nothing else to do in the recap, so we may as well look at the base sets. One base, base set, the gold base set, and the blue base set variants. But with that, let us wrap off this opening here for Greg. So thank you so much, Greg, for let me do a quick rip of some basketball cards for you here. Really hope you enjoyed the opening. 
and love these new additions to your collection. I'll be out here watching. I hope that you enjoyed the video as well. So if you did, don't forget to go ahead and hit that like button. Comments for me, drop those down below. And of course, if you're not yet part of the Titan Cards family, we'd love to have you join us here. Make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Yes, that is actually all I had today. The Weiss boxes and the basketball. Looks like today is going to be a bit of a lighter week, although I do think regular Prism basketball is coming out this week. Usually our fancier baseball and football products and basketball as well, fancier sports products in general, tend to sell in store more so than online. So not sure if I'll get to opening up any Prism basketball here on the channel. I mean, I'd love to. But I don't know that I actually will. But who knows? Who knows what may happen this week? Things have been crazy for me as of late, so you never know. Might have some more basketball, although I would say probably not this week. But with that, I think that wraps up everything. I told you guys to like and subscribe and all that cringe. Last thing for me to do is to wrap things off here in the video by giving an extra special shout out to all of our channel members. Thank you so much, you all, for going above and beyond with your support. Boss Ben and I truly do appreciate it. We do have seven Black Label fans, Andon, Devon, Mako, MT, Sean F, Stephen Olivo, and Stephen Bly. We also do have six Gemmit fans, Bamboo, Jayat Geek, Michael C, Michael Bigelow, Scorecard Collectibles, and Woots0005. But thank you so much again to all of our channel members, and all members do have their names shown on screen at the end of every video. But with that, I believe that does wrap things on off for me here today. So thank you so much for watching, everyone. Take care, stay safe, and hope you all join me in the next video. Bye.